Wow. 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 This was news I was not expecting today. And I was trying to be productive today. I mean, slap bang in the middle of doing a bit of recording in the hope that we might get a bit of news today about a potential extended calendar for 2020 when this beauty drops in the Twitters. Oh my goodness me. I was not expecting this. Oh my goodness me. Is this not one of the nicest liveries we've seen for a long time? Wow. I've just literally jumped on to record this. This isn't going to be a long video and certainly this won't be a structured video. But today, Mercedes have dropped a new livery for 2020. A very different livery. Gone is the silver. In is a black turquoise and cherry red livery. Only a few days ago. We did our first of our June car launches with Williams and we had a bit of a joke about doing a car launch or livery reveal in June. And now we've got two. It's race week. And before we go racing, we've got one final livery to analyze. And I absolutely love it. Now, I do want to quickly touch on the reason the team have done this. And in their official statement over on Twitter, Introducing our new 2020 livery, a pledge to improve diversity within our team and within our sport and a signal of the team's commitment to fighting racism and discrimination in all its forms, which is a fantastic reason to change up the livery this season. Lewis Hamilton, who's been far more vocal than he, he needs to be, but it's fantastic to see. And it's great to see the Formula One community rallying behind all these causes at the moment. And it's certainly something that I am looking and trying my best to help out with as well. But on a livery side of things, yes, I certainly wasn't expecting this, and this news to come out this week. And it's unclear through this vague statement whether it's gonna be a full season livery, but Judging by that little first sentence, introducing our new 2020 livery, I think it must be a full season livery. And it's just lovely. I, I'm really stuck for words on this one. It's pretty much just a recolor of their initial silver livery. They've got the stars still in there and they've been converted to a silver and they were initially black. So they've kind of inverted the silver elements to black and the black elements to silver but aesthetically I really really like it the halo looks great as well I'm just having a bit of a zoom in on the halo and there is the wing there the little winglet on top of the halo there's the end racism statement on there as well but I cannot see the rainbow or um, what was the statement uh, we drive as one, we race as one. That's it, isn't it? I, I can't see that logo anywhere at the moment, but maybe they'll put that in elsewhere. And maybe this is their way and their own interpretation of tackling that issue and incorporating the we race as one symbolism into the livery itself. So I'll leave that there because I don't want to drone on too long, but I love it. I really, really love it. And if I was already... Not super, ex well, of course I was super excited, wasn't I, for the new season. This is oh, something else, ladies and gentlemen. Apolo I Just, you know, just now, I've zoomed in. It's on the mirror. It's on the driver mirror. We race as one. The hashtag, the rainbow, found it. Happy days. I've got work to crack on with. Videos later on this afternoon and tomorrow, so keep your eyes out for those. Thank you all very much for watching this quick update. And of course, if you want to keep up to date with all 2020 news, feel free to subscribe. Thanks, guys, and I'll see you in the next one.